Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about incidence matrix of a digraph. The incidence matrix of a digraph with n vertices and m arcs is a n cross m matrix in which each entry is 0 or 1 or minus 1. Rows of incidence matrix correspond to vertices and columns correspond to arcs. If there is a digraph G in which there is an arc EK from vertex I to vertex J, then in the incidence matrix of digraph G, the entry at ith row and kth column will be minus 1 and entry at jth row and kth column will be 1 and all other entries in column k will be 0. Now see this diagram. This is the incidence matrix of this digraph. This digraph has four vertices and five arcs. So the incidence matrix of this digraph has four rows and five columns. There is an arc even in this digraph from vertex 1 to vertex 2. So in the incidence matrix of this digraph, the entry at first row and first column is minus 1 and entry at second row and first column is 1 and all other entries of column 1 are 0. There is an arc E2 from vertex 2 to vertex 3 in digraph. Therefore, in incidence matrix, the entry at second row and second column is minus 1 and entry at third row, second column is 1 and other entries of second column are 0. There is an arc E3 from vertex 3 to vertex 4. Therefore, in incidence matrix, the entry at third row and third column is minus 1 and entry at fourth row and third column is 1 and all other entries in third column are 0. There is an arc E4 from vertex 2 to vertex 4. Therefore, in the incidence matrix, the entry at second row and fourth column is minus 1 and entry at fourth row and fourth column is 1 and all other entries in fourth column are 0. There is an arc E5 from vertex 4 to vertex 1. Therefore, in incidence matrix, the entry at 4th row and 5th column is minus 1. And entry at 1st row and 5th column is 1. And all other entries in 5th column are 0. Thank you very much.